Hey there. So I have had my own home office for the past 10 years. It started out as me having a space to work out for my last corporate job, which was back in 2010. And then I started my consulting business from home with my own workspace. Now it didn't start out like this. In the very beginning, I did not have a desk and the shelves and the magnetic boards and all the tools and equipments that you see today. But I did start out with a folding table, a folding table from Office Depot that uh, was like two and a half by four feet and it was a little wobbly. So the way that we secured it against the wall was to get those, you know, those two sided strips that's like Velcro so that it would move two or three strips of those and it did the job. Now, if you don't have an actual desk, any flat surface will do where you can get started to design, create a workspace that you will love, that you will feel, feel creative and productive in. So today I wanna to go over four different levels, all budget friendly, but as you go up a level, you will spend a little bit more money and a little bit more money and a little bit more money, but it's all budget friendly. It's not going to break the bank, but it is going to allow you to have a much more productive and efficient workspace. Some things are a nice to have, other things are a must have. So let me get you started. My name is Veronica Sagastumi and I am a business strategist and consultant. I started my consulting company 10 years ago working outside of home. Now in all transparency about two or three years ago, I did get an uh, office outside of the home to do more of like my video filming and to hold uh, meetings in. But I still use my home office every single day. So let's get started with the bare bones of things that you need to work from home. You may have just started working from home or it may start set settling in that you're gonna be working from home for a while or you're starting to realize you can start a business or work from home all the time but you need a much more efficient and productive workspace. That's what I'm gonna help you with. You don't need to write any of these things down that I'm gonna show you because I have created a resource for you that I am going to make available. You know, you're going to be able to, you know, click the link below this video and grab it. There's no opt-in. You don't need to give me your name or your email address. It's just a resource for you where it's got the picture of every single item that I have uh, here on my desk that I'm gonna share with you today. And it's got a brief description and an estimated pricing. But the, if you click on the image, it'll take you to the link of where you can purchase it. But not only that, but you'll be able to see if there's a quantity, color, uh, or a different type of alternative um, item that you want to purchase. You don't have to purchase all of this, all of these things, but you may see something, a gadget or a tool that you think would make your workspace even better. So let's get started. This is what I call bare bones. Bare bones means you have a laptop. Now this is a nice little cover and the keyboards, but you have a laptop. If you have a laptop, you're ready to go because the bare bones means that you can open it up. You can use the camera that comes with your laptop. Most laptops have, you know, your, their own built-in camera and they have their mic and speaker built in. So could you get started with this? Absolutely. Should you? For a while. But if you want to up, upgrade a little bit, here's what I would call the bare bones. Bare bones would be, um, let's see, let me go here and make sure that I get it all right. Just the very minimum, these are headphones. Headphones will allow you to have a little bit more privacy, especially if you have more people at home than you're used to right now during these uh, COVID-19 times. If you're watching this video way past it, I hope you all came out of it all right. And you know, it's a new way of doing things. These two little headphones, one is more, I, I use the, these for my iPhone and these for my Mac, but you can use the exact same one for both your smartphone and your Mac. It allows you to have a little bit more privacy and the sound quality is a little bit better. Boom, one set of headphones, right? One set of headphones, iPhone, smartphone, laptop, you're done. Now you may be um, wondering what these little things are. We'll get to these in a little bit because these we're going over the bare bones. So you've got a laptop, getting started, use the built-in web, built-in mic and speaker. Next we have the, um, the headphones and after that is what I call my four port USB hub. See that? Because most of our MacBooks or PC laptops, they only have one, maybe two if you're lucky, uh, USB ports. You're gonna need more than that eventually. This makes it so easy. And again, these are all budget friendly. So I think this was like less than $10, $9.99 to be specific. 
but four ports is awesome. And some of your, like the, you're gonna, I want you to ignore all the stuff in the background right now. Let's just pretend that all I've got is the laptop because this is all I had to get started. And there is an adapter that goes in here that then you have a USB adapter. It doesn't lose any kind of connection. It's great. It's, I have quite a few of these handy and um, we've used them for years. I think this one I bought like three years ago and it works great. The only thing is don't forget to push the buttons because if you don't push the buttons, it's not on, which is a great energy saver. Okay. All right. Let's keep going. Next thing is my ring light, which of course I cannot find right now. Um, I thought I had everything out, but it's a cute little ring light. There it is. I knew I had it. It's a ring light. This little ring light, um, it's just really powerful and I needed to put new batteries in it and I wasn't ready. It's a clip. See this clip? If you have an iPhone, it has three settings, boom, you don't cover the, the peephole, but if you want it on your laptop, there it is. So now, instead of being poorly lit, you are well lit. If you put your, uh, your headphones, now your sound quality has improved, your lighting has improved, people can see you better, right? So far, so good, awesome. Let's keep going. These are my favorite. I love these. They're cable drops. What it is, is it's basically an organizational thing to keep your, your cables secure. And this is where I would say, let me get up and go show you. Okay. It's a little messy right now because I want to have everything handy. But do you see those? Do you see how there's a black one there and a pink one there? It just keeps everything very secure. And it allows you to... I know that you can't see me right now, but that's just because I'm putting this back. But it allows you to keep everything so secure and in place and not worry about the cables dropping to the back of your desk or being all tangled up. Um, these are super cheap. I think they're again $9.99. And uh, the link when you click on the, on the image of the resource that I told you, you know, grab it below this video. Don't, don't go right there right now, but you can grab it and have it available to you. If you click on the image, it'll take you right to the link of where you can purchase them. There's all kinds of colors if you wanna have color coordinated or go with a basic black. What you didn't see is that I have quite a few of these behind my desk, behind the, the desk here, because then that's where I usually will put a lot of my cables so that I can get them out of the way, put them there, have easy access to them, but they won't fall to the back of the desk. And so I think that does it for the bare bones of um, equipment. So, quick recap. You've got your built-in uh, webcam, you've got your built-in speaker and mic. Then if you wanna up-level, you can get uh, your headphones, headphones that came with your smartphone, or you can buy some, uh, a little fancier ones. I like, I especially like these, and I'm gonna tell you why, is because they come with different size, so these little rubber eerie things that I don't know the actual term for, but um, I like them so that I can get the actual size that fits my ears better and it doesn't go it, they don't fall out for some reason the headphones that come with this my iPhone always fall out and it's uncomfortable so then we said we upgrade a little bit to the bare bones by getting um, the clip-on like the clip-on like light I think is like $19 uh, there's different price points so go check them out click on the link that I that's in my resource but then you'll see other alternatives below uh, and then the other one was the keep your cables organized because once you have a workspace like this, remember, let's say all you have is your laptop right now, that's all you need. You spend less than $50, I think $40, boom, you're done. You've got a really comfortable uh, laptop where you can speak and listen to things in privacy. You can keep your cables organized and you can have more than one hub to connect all of your gadgets to. All right, let's go to what the next level would be the basics. And the basics is thinking, okay, you've got your standard that comes equipment, then you've got your bare bones. Now we're gonna build on to that. It's like a stackable building onto your office space. And that is called like the basics. The basics would be getting your laptop up. Okay, so now we're going to pretend that this laptop went over here. Now we're going to say, okay, this laptop is, we're raising it with a stand. And I love this stand and I'll tell you why, because ignore the under desk keyboard. Let's just pretend it's right here. I love it because when I first started before I got really fancy with this under the desk mount, um, I could get my keyboard out of the way very easily and 
have an area so that I could that I could write on. So that's always, you know, dual purpose right there. But so here we are. We've got the basics is all about getting a stand for your laptop, right? Here it is. You there's a lot of different options. Again, when you click on the link in the resource that I'm sharing with you that you can grab below, you can see what other options are available if you scroll down. Most of these things you can grab in at Amazon. I think that the stand, the different prices, this one was around $29 or $39. Then there's keyboards. I've used several different keyboards. In the research that I'm sharing with you, I've got keyboards for both PC and Mac. Both of them will work with a Mac. The PC one is better for the PC laptop. Um, but the whole thing is getting those types of keyboards that have the low keys. Um, I always use a 10 key, but you can, you don't need to do that and I've got wireless. I just don't like a lot of wires around. That's my preference. Yours can be different. But now that we've got a laptop up on a stand, you know, let's say that this was in front of me, I can then, you know, type away right in front. I've got more level instead of doing the whole neck thing where I'm like down below looking at the screen down here. And I've also got an ergonomically correct mouse. Again, this is a Mac mouse. You don't need this. If you have a MacBook, you can get a PC uh, mouse and a PC um, keyboard to work with your Mac. It's just, you know, the little USBs. And as a matter of fact, I always have a backup mouse and it's a PC mouse and it works beautifully. As long as I have the use USB adapter, perfect. All right, so, so far so good. The basics, we get a little stand to put to, um, put our laptop on, we get a wireless keyboard and mouse, and then we are on to my little favorite gadget, which do you need this? Probably not. This is my phone stand. The link that I share with you is a better version. It, you know, see how this swivels? It's awesome. There's another one here, the newer version that I'm giving you access to. Now, why do I love this? Look, it's so great to be able to, um, I can watch a video, um, I can watch a show if I want. I can have my conference calls. Sometimes I do uh, FaceTime with relatives or Skype with clients and it's right here on the phone. But it's just so nice to be able to have it here on the side, wherever you want, so that you can have easy access to it. Um, I love it. It's one of my favorite gadgets. It is super inexpensive. I think it's less than $15 and I love it. I, I take it with me as I'm getting ready. Uh, maybe I'm cooking, whatever. Um, you know, your smartphone is like your mini TV anyway, your mini computer, mini TV, it all things. So it's awesome to have. All right, let's keep going because that, my friends, was all that I had for the basics. Next, we have up level. Now, most things that I've shared so far are around $9.99, $14.99, $19.99. Now we're going up to another level. This is for when you are, you're thinking, okay, well, I'm gonna be at home a lot longer than I thought, so I better make my office space a lot more comfortable, productive, what do I need in order for me to function better? One of the things that you're going to need is this webcam. The webcam here, this is a Logitech C920. Let me tell you, these usually go for around $59. Right now, if you're watching this uh, video in real time, we are in the midst of COVID-19. We're all having to stay at home, work from home. Uh, the students are having to learn from home. And so the price of this Logitech C920, which is usually $59, has been quoted from anywhere from $150 to $250, which is outrageous. Do me a favor and check out eBay and check out um, Office Depot, Staples, wherever you buy office supplies, because I think you can get a better alternative. Before I, I started to record this video, I went onto eBay and I found a C, I think it was a C20. This is a C920. There's another Logitech webcam. Look, any webcam at this point, I think I bought it for $41. I bought it for Eric, my significant other in the other room. Um, he's been using his uh, laptop webcam and it's not, it's not the best. And I think just with a little bit of effort, we went and found a $41 webcam. It'll do for now. Any webcam at this point will be better than nothing. So again, I'm sharing the exact one that I have here. I've had this for four years and it's work, it works great and it plugs in, it's a USB connector. I like it because it's very portable. I can easily change it and make it fit and adjust it so it goes for, on the monitor or the laptop. Um, even a teleprompter if you want. So 
C920 Logitech webcam. That's to up level your workspace. And as you can see, when I have it here, it's awesome because we'll get to that next, which is my mini light. This is a mini ring light. This, the, the Logitech pricing is all over the place, but this one, the price is around $48. It has three different um, attachments, but also I wanna just turn it on for you and show you that it's got different, you see how it goes down and it goes up, you see that? This is a blue light, cream, blue, white, cream, blue, white, cream. Let's leave the cream one on and you see how much brighter I can get it? This at your desk behind your webcam for $48, $49, less than $50, it's amazing. And I usually have it right here because depending on the time of day, I need the different lighting, okay? But I freaking love it. It's on a tripod so it can get very short. This swivels so I can get it, see how I had, it, I had to have it to the side because my shelf was in the way? It's okay. It's on a tripod, it can get really high but it's a mini light. It's not a diva ring light. It's not a newer light. It is a mini light. And for less than $50, you can be well lit. Now, think about that. It is amazing, right? You've got your webcam, you've got a light, you know, you've got your gadget with your phone, your laptop's up on the stand. You've got a wireless keyboard and mouse. It's feeling pretty good, right? Let's keep going. The next thing that I'm gonna share with you is this lavalier mic. Um, I have an extension here so I can get it to be really long. But this lavalier light uh, mic allows me to plug it into my smartphone or into my laptop. I can clip it and it just the sound quality is so awesome and because it's in place you never get that rattling or muffle like when you have your headphones and you're trying to record something or you're trying to have a call you may have a little bit of static as it rubs against your jewelry or your your shirt or your hair or you know guys i don't know your tie so this allows you to clip it in place and plug it into into whatever gadget you want that has this kind of adapter i think these this light right here is about $14.99, $15. So I just love it because it allows you to do, you know, to have a lot more freedom. Your sound quality is amazing, but this is not what you would use to have a conference call or a video call because um, you can't hear back. So this is just for when you're recording something. All right, so let's keep going here. The next thing I'm gonna say, I'm gonna actually bring it over. Actually, I'm gonna get up and show you. Can you see this clip? It's a clip light. It's a light with your iPhone and it clips onto your desk. Do you see that? Okay, well that little light allows you to clip it onto, let's say a windowsill or a, a desk or a, a shelf, a bookcase, something where you want to have, you want to be well lit. And again, that light, um, the thing about that light is that it doesn't plug into power. It actually plugs into a USB port. So it, it plugs into like your computer, but you can try other things. I think that all I've used it for is with my computer. So it's a clip on light. I think that the price for that is around $18. And you know what? I freaking love it. It's a little light that lights you up really well, but sometimes when you're doing like an Instagram live or some sort of live conference call, Skype, or even a Facebook live, whatever it is that you're using your phone for to connect with somebody else on the other line, on the other side um, of your screen, then it's an awesome little alternative. The next thing, guys, I don't have a picture of it because that is my beautiful big calendar. It's an erasable calendar for the entire year got every single month you one side is portrait one side is the other side is landscape you can write on it you can scribble on it you can circle you can do whatever and then erase it I love it it is one of the best things that I ever bought in twin in December to to plan my year so that's in the resource again so you can grab that resource by clicking the link below this video and we're gonna keep going because so far we've got you know bare bones the basics up level. Now we're going to what I call the four star level. The four star level is where you start investing in some things and it's gonna be a little bit pricier. So for that, let me bring down my Yeti mic. This Yeti mic is always connected. This Yeti mic allows my sound to be amazing. Um, I got a little, uh, I 
can't remember what this is called, but it's by Dragon Pad and it's a buffer because then it, you know how sometimes we pronounce our P's or our T's really, they're very harsh. This muffles that a little bit, but the sound is amazing. It's always plugged in. This is a little bit pricier. It's around $130. I did not invest in this for quite a few months. It wasn't uh, for quite a few years and it wasn't until I started to record a lot more videos that I wanted, um, you know, screen videos. Obviously, I'm showing you this, so this is not plugged in. But this is a USB. This is a USB mic. So let's make sure that um, I state I state that. The other thing is, again, I'm going to get up and show you. I'm going to mention the next few things. The mic, a 10-port USB hub, and an external drive. These are all things that are a little bit pricier. The the 10 port hub, I think is like $25, not a lot. Um, the other one, the external hard drive, depending on how many terabytes you want, it could be get, get it pricier. The resource that I've shared with you has two terabytes and that in itself, can you see that? So there is the 10 port hub and there is your external drive. Okay, right there. Got my tripod in the back there. Okay. Um, I love it because I can back up all of my audio files, videos, sound, anything that I think has, uh, I wanna make sure that I leave more storage in my on my desktop or Dropbox or Box or whatever you're using. I And it's always good to have another backup. So I do back up a lot of files onto that external drive. So right now, two terabyte is more than enough. Now that's one of those um, external drives. The one, that, the resource one that I'm sharing with you is this one, it is a passport one. Um, it's very, it's compact, I carry it with me. Um, nothing confidential in here other than just a lot of video files, podcast audios, uh, courses, trainings, whatever. Um, it's very compact and I bought the cases extra. So I think this was around $66, not too bad. Now I'm gonna turn this because I'm gonna share with you, this is the newer light. Newer light is a ring light. It's not the Diva ring light. This light is around $99. It comes with all kinds of gadgets. It comes with its own tripod. It comes with a lot of different filters. Again, you can check out all of its cool features by clicking on the link in the research that I'm sharing with you. But I'm gonna turn this around. I am filming this from my guest room. So here you go. There is the light. You can kind of see it, right? It's on a tripod. And you talk about the behind the scenes, right? All right, so you're getting to see all of it, all of it. All right, that is almost it. I wanted to share with you also, this is the tripod that I recommend. It's a lot sturdier than the usual aluminum one. I love it. I think this one's only like $24.99, but oh my God, it extends, obviously you can extend so much. I don't want to show you the whole thing, but you know, it's a lot of different lengths. You can put it on your desk or you can put it on the floor. Um, I, I just, I love it for, I can use it for my camera, I use it for my iPhone, I use it for my webcam as well. It's just all kinds of gadgets that it comes with. It's easy to, to maneuver, it's easy to take apart, it's easy to just, I don't know, I, I love it. It's just so, it's so fun to, you see how all the little gadgets that you can take apart. So all of these things that I'm showing you, are they a must have? No. See that? I'm just going to take that apart. This is like... I would have a different gadget for a different adapter for my camera. These are all things that will make your workspace a lot more efficient depending on what it is that you use it for. Do you need all of these things? No, I didn't add all of these things all at once. I added them as I, as my business changed, as it evolved, as I needed some more space or I needed to work more efficiently. Uh, of course, you probably noticed by now that I have two laptops. This laptop stays in my, at my office at all times. I still go and see cons uh, clients. I have a consulting business and so when I travel, I take my travel laptop. It's a lot smaller. If I travel uh, to a conference, I take my smaller one. It's really light. This one's a lot bigger. It's heavier. So we leave it at home. All right. So you guys, don't worry about writing all of this down because I not only um, am giving you that resource, but I also give you a little bit more um, gadgets. This video has gone on a long time now, but just a few more things. This is what I call a taco. See that? Again, I share with this with you in the resource. The thing is, why do I need this? Do I need this? No. The thing is, I usually travel with a lot of things. A USB adapter, two headphones, 
maybe another uh, a mic like you know what I'm using right now it gets they get tangled up but if I just quickly roll them up and put them in my little taco here now they are so much easier to access and detangle um, like anything else as you start working you're gonna need things like I've got an external speaker just the sound is better when I'm listening to something if I don't have my headphones on awesome right and this is my go-to notebook I've used this notebook for years um, it's sturdy it's a little bit pricier I think it's like $15 but it's spiral bound I freaking love it I've got so many of these and the last one is the caddy the caddy and the inbox I don't know if you can see that you can see that the caddy and the inbox you go search just standard office supplies. Why am I giving you that? Because after 25 years in business as a uh, CFO, as a COO, as a you know business owner working from home, I have used so many things. This is my favorite. I'm just sharing things that I have purchased and that I use and that I love. So there you have it. I'm Veronica Sagastimi. I'm a business strategist and consultant, and I help accounting professionals take their experience, monetize it by starting a consulting business. But the thing about this is that I have had my own home office for years. I have made a living, I have grown a business, I have serviced clients from the comfort of my home. The shelves, the, the bulletin board, the other things, you know, the desk, these things came from Ikea or from Pottery Barn. I did not invest in that right away. I needed to have my workspace be comfortable for the every stage that I was growing into. So I hope this has been helpful. Don't forget to grab the resource down below. Just click on the link, no opt-in. You don't need to give me your email. It's just a resource for you to use, share as you wish. And if you like this video, please hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you can get future videos with best practices, tips, tricks, hacks, and a lot more. I will see you next time. Bye for now.